the Fed, they did come out and they said, all of your bond holdings that are marked down 30%, you can mark them back to par and use that as collateral as if it were at par. And I think that's a potential or let's say theoretical injection of around two to $3 trillion. And so that's partially the reason why I think gold is rallying, going to make a new high, why Bitcoin and Ethereum are strong, why the NASDAQ is strong. I mean, we can get into that. I think that those trends that are driven by liquidity in the NASDAQ, gold, Bitcoin, Ethereum, they're driven more, I think, by expectations of liquidity rather than whether the underlying US or global economy is going to be growing at a certain rate.